Yo guys and girls and welcome back to Dr. Dave. So yesterday, which would have been the 27th, was Black Friday and Sneak dropped their Blankberry flavour. It's just arrived. Uh, I bought two tubs of this and I also got the Blankberry shaker. So we'll just put the powder down for a minute. As you know, it is called Blankberry, and you can blatantly tell there is nothing. There is no, there's no bunny face on the cup. There's no information on the back of the cup. It is just all blank. And then, let's say you've got the Blankberry. You know, it's all it's all blanked out, other than the Blankberry word and a bit of sneak branding. You know, you've got all of the. Um, information on the back it's got like obviously their address and what's what sneak contains the barcode and so on and so forth but it is um very sparse because obviously it's called blankberry but on all the pictures that i saw and you know i saw a lot you know i follow sneak on instagram and I was looking at this stuff, and this cup on all of the fi all of the pictures that they showed, this cup was white. And this cup is definitely not white; it is grey. You know, if we look here and we show you the back of the box, this is white. This is a hundred percent grey, and the rest of the box is grey. But looking at the pictures that they posted on Instagram and so on and so forth, this did look white. So when it arrived, I was quite shocked that it was actually grey. Then obviously you've got the tub. And the tub is blank as well. You know, there is literally nothing on it other than a bit of moulding on the actual pot itself with the sneak branding. But, you know, I did the, you know, the little lick test to see if I would like the flavour. And on the lick test, you know, you lick your finger, just touch a little bit of powder and taste it. And doing this reminded me of Frutella, Berry Frutellas or um, Berry Starburst Sweets. That's what this reminded me of. There's the there's the colour of the powder. It's not really showing up that great on camera, but it's um, I don't know it's, it's it looks kind of grey on the webcam, but it's got more of a a reddish hue to it. But when I originally um, took the cap off, I'll show you what the the cap looks like from the second box. Um, you know, on the other sneak tubs that I got, you know, it was more of a kind of a papery texture, but this one, this time around, it's more of a plastic. You know, I, I didn't see this on the other sneak products that I bought. It was more of a kind of a paper um, over the top, or like thick paper, maybe cardboard, but this one seems to be plastic and uh, when I when I peeled this off it looked like a glitter bomb had gone off in my kitchen you know I pulled this tab off and obviously as you're peeling it off you create disturbance inside the tub so I like turned around in the kitchen when I peeled this when I peeled this one off and like I said, it looked like a glitter bomb had gone off in the kitchen. There was like all glitter particles all in the air. And it was um, a bit mad, to be fair. So we're going to... Um, I've already got my water in my um, shaker. So we're uh, stick the lids back on. Stick the lid back on this one. Put it back in its box. Because this one isn't open. Put that to one side. I'm going to take the, the lid off of the new shaker and, uh, and the grill. 
I'm going to try and do this on, on camera so you can see what colour the... As you all know, if you've ever bought a sneak product before, you know there is a bunny engraved into the spoon handle and also on the bottom of the spoon. Yeah, honestly, don't uh, don't shake this stuff up too much. So here we go. See, that's going like a blood red colour by the look of it. Right, so we'll. Uh yeah, that definitely has gone definitely a blood red colour. Oh, it smells so good as well. Right, with these grills, I have found that when you sit them just inside the cup, especially when you've dishwashed them, um, you know, they the cups kind of expand a little bit. So, you know... Push the, push the grill a little bit further down in the cup so it's not loose and flapping around when you're shaking your beaker. Because nothing worse than the clink clank clink clank clink clank noise. We'll shake this and then we'll we'll open it up again in a sec to show you the uh, the colour. But honestly, it smells absolutely amazing. Right, so we're going to open this back up. As you can see, it's definitely... ...like a bl blood red colour inside. Still reminding me of, like, Frutella. Tell her is a bad man, sweet. Yeah, definitely. Or, like I said, it could be um, Berry Starburst. You know, Berry Starburst done a bag um, of just berry flavour. And, you know, like, I love the berry flavours. Um, I'm not a fan of, like, lime or anything like that. So, Jade normally has the mixed bag, and I tend to have the, the berry bags. Right, I'm going to try this for the first time. I say I wasn't expecting this to arrive till Monday because, um, you know, I put my order in and it came back and said to, um, that the, the order wouldn't be arriving till Monday. And then when Jade came into the bedroom this morning, there was uh, a box of Sneak, so I was over the moon with that. Right, so cheers Sneak for the new flavour and let's have a chug. Yes, definitely. Definitely um, tastes like like a black currant frutella or a black currant but uh, black currant um, starburst chewy sweet. That's what it reminds me of, and it's really really refreshing as well. It's not um, it's not one of them punch you in the balls kind of flavors. You know, like the sour apple, you know, you have one of those and that's like, blows your mind, like, but this is a very, very, you know, it's not subtle, but it's very smooth. See, I could see myself drinking a lot of this, you know, if Sneak brought this out as a, a regular reoccurring flavour on Black Friday, then, or even, you know, mass produced it and put it out as one of their flavours, I would 100% buy this. You know, I my favourite of all time still is the Tropicilla, but this is definitely coming, you know, a uh, in in second place now. This is this has kicked um, Cherry down the third, and this one has definitely got to be my second favourite flavour. I've also, um, I also bought a box of um, 20 sachets because 
I haven't tried the Strawberry Millions flavour yet, so we will be trying that at some point. But, yeah, now, other than the limited editions that I didn't get to try, like the Unleashed, um, the Blackout, and the Blizzard, you know, I've tried every single flavour that Sneak have got. And I'm really impressed. So, I, you know, I haven't had a canned energy drink since moving over to Sneak, and I don't, I don't plan to. So, my thoughts and feelings on the new flavour, absolutely love it. You know, if you love, like, Frutella or Starburst Chew Sweets, then this is going to be right up your street. Thanks very much for joining me, guys. And as always, I've been Dr. Dave. You guys have been amazing. And we will catch you on the next one. So bye for now.